Hello YouTube! It's Talia here, your vegan amiga, and I am back with a delicious Trader Joe's frozen meal that I'm very excited about. I believe it's brand new. I just picked it up last weekend, I believed. I believed. I believe, um, and I am just getting around to making it now. It is the Tetboki, Tetboki, I don't know if I'm actually saying that right. I think I am. But it looks like this. It's basically rice cakes in like a spicy sweet sauce. It is, it smells amazing. It looks amazing. And I've only ever had rice cakes like this, or Tetboki, I should say. Um, once before and it wasn't that good like the place that i got it from was kind of first of all my order took i ordered it online and then when i got there it was like a huge line of people waiting like from uber eats and like postmates and stuff so it just took forever to get to, like to my turn and then when i finally did get the food it wasn't even that good so i was like ooh, you know maybe i don't like that but i think it was the location because yeah i just this smells amazing so let's just get right into it um i actually cooked the rice cakes two different ways um, there's the original just like way um, on the stove top with like boiling water you know kind of like pasta I guess um, where you you know cook up the rice cakes and they get chewy um, but then I also air fried them because they had the directions on the back for that I only air fried a couple of them uh, like maybe like 10 or so um, so yeah those should be a little bit crispier and they are on the top so I'm gonna dig right in let's just mm. My mouth is watering. I also put some sesame seeds and green onion on top for extra flavor. So yeah, let's just dig right in. Oh my gosh, this might be real difficult with uh, chopsticks. All right, here we go. First bite. Oh my god, it looks so, so good. Very, very excited. Here we go. Might be a little hot. Mmm. Oh, they're so chewy. I love it. Yum. Mmm. Wow. That's really good. It's definitely sweet, but then it has a, a kick to it. But it's not like overly like spicy, I don't feel. Ooh. I think this one's a crunchy one, so air fried one, I should say. Mmm. 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 They definitely lost a little bit of their crunch just because I had to put them in the sauce for a little bit, but they're still so good. Mmm. That sauce. It's so good. I had tried a little bit of the sauce when I was making it. And I was like, oh man, this is really sweet. Like, I don't know. Huh. But. The spice definitely kicks in. And then with the rice cake. It's just perfect. Mmm. Also, it's a perfect day for a hot bowl of um, tetboki because it is almost 100 degrees outside. So, nice and comforting and warm on this hot day. <laughs> Gosh, ooh, it's getting, the spice is really kicking in there, huh? Mmm. Mmm. I also have a little bowl of uh, just some more green onions in here just to add a little bit more because I know I love green onions. So I figured I should just have a lot on hand. Mmm. -mm -mm. It's 
hard to pick up. <laughs> Jesus. Here we go. Mmm. Let's have a spoon here because I could be done with these chopsticks really soon. Who knows? Like I said, it's really hot today. And it was really hot yesterday. We've been having a little bit of a heat wave. Not, not anything crazy. Well, temperature's a little crazy, but not crazy in the sense of like how long the heat wave's gonna last. It's literally gonna be, it was only yesterday and today and then tomorrow it starts to cool down a lot. So that's exciting, but I don't mind the heat. I love the heat. Yesterday we went to, it was, Sean was off work, so we went to eat lunch in Long Beach on 2nd Street. And then we headed over to the beach. There's like this little cove kind of area. Not cove, but I just swallowed a green onion. Oh my god. Um... It's like a t little like area, like a bay, I guess, where there's no waves and you can like take out paddle boards and like hikes and stuff. Or it's like a really good place for kids to go because there's no waves and it's just like still water, you know, really nice. And it's not super, I mean, it get, I think it gets deep, but it's like takes a while to get to like the deeper part, you know. Mm. So I went there and it was super cute super fun day just like I fell asleep in the sun it was so nice oh, I love falling asleep at the beach and then we we said that for a while I was surprised we lasted that long because it was really hot it was so crazy. It was actually one of my friend's birthday. And she has a newborn. It's almost going to be, well, is newborn? Six months. He's about to be six months next month. It's technically newborn, right? Newborn, right? It's like, it's only been six months. Well, anyways, um, it was her birthday. And they were at the same beach we were at. We, they were literally, like, just across the way. And we didn't even see them. I didn't see, didn't find out until after... Like we had already gone home and I saw her story, I was like on Instagram and I texted her, I was like, oh my gosh, we were there too. Girl, it would've been so cool to see you. All on your birthday, you know? What? They had a cute little family day, so that was nice for them. And then me and Sean just literally, wow. <laughs> napped and then went in the water for a little bit. Mm. Tanned. Somebody left behind a little, um, you know those like sand molds. They left one of those behind. It's like a, it was like a dinosaur shape and I made a whole bunch of them. Felt like a kid again. And then we left around 4.30 and I really was craving a Slurpee. Cause it was just so hot and it sounded perfect. And it was perfect. Oh, really hit the spot. I don't want another one today. <laughs> Just so much sugar. I probably should not. But every once in a while, it's fine. Oh my gosh, I really can't grab this. I might, it might be time for the spoon. 
Okay, here we go. My nose is running. This is very, very spicy. <laughs> This is a lot of rice cakes. Mm. The green onion is a nice, like, refreshing bite. I'm really glad it's cooling down though in the next couple days because I desperately want to make corn chowder. Oh. It just sounds so good. I haven't had corn, ch corn chowder in so long. And it just sounds amazing. So I was thinking of doing it today, making it today, but not with this heat so probably Monday because it cools down it's gonna be like 68 degrees on Monday so that's perfect perfect soup weather mm -mm -mm. also exciting news exciting news for me I guess <laughs> I did my taxes this week and I'm getting a good amount of money back so that's very happy. Very, very good news. And so yeah, just kind of looking forward to that dropping in my bank account one of these days. There really are a lot of pieces in here. I'm getting full. I don't think I'm gonna be able to finish this. It's really good, but it's a lot. Very filling. I'm getting to burp. But it's not coming. Excuse me. <laughs> that was attractive. I like saw my face when I did that. <laughs> See, I got a little bit of room. <laughs> Got a cute new rug today. It's like a it's really small, but I'm looking at it right now. That's why I even mentioned it. But it's from Target, and it's it's only five dollars, so good deal. Very random, but I just thought I should mention it. If you're looking, it's like a jute rug. Jute. That's the word, right? I think so. I have the. Cotton woven rug, maybe not jute. That's where I saw the word jute somewhere, but maybe not. Whatever, it's really cute. 
I can't show you though because my table's on it. So really don't know why I mentioned it. I just thought I would. <laughs> Anyways, ooh, I'm pretty full. I'm going to take one last bite. And then I'm going to call it a day because this is, this is a lot. Ooh. Splatter. Delicious. Gotta clean that up before it uh, dries. Okay, my nose is really runny. <laughs> it's the spice. Yum, 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 yum. Wow. Definitely recommend these. I feel like I need to eat them with something else. You know, it was good to have, like, the green onion. Definitely, like, cut up the... Cut up, no. That's not what I'm trying to say. It definitely um, kind of broke the different, like, the same kind of texture. Because with the rice cakes and the sauce, it's just kind of one note, you know what I mean? As far as texture. Um, but with the green onion, it's really... adds a little bit of crunch and then, like, freshness. Um, so maybe with something else, I don't know, like... I don't... Maybe spring rolls would be good. Just because you could, like, dip it in the sauce, too. <gasps> That'd be amazing. Spring rolls would be good. Um, what else? I don't know. I can't think of, like... Maybe you could even add things to this. Like, you could make it, like, a stir-fry, kind of. And put, like broccoli and carrots and mushrooms that'd be delicious but either way i mean it's amazing it's really really good so i definitely recommend you try this i think it was only like five bucks or something like that maybe less but it comes with a lot and it's really good this is definitely better than that one restaurant i ordered from I ordered from like a while ago so that tells you anything well, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe if you like what you see here. And also, please comment down below if you've ever tried Thick Bulky or if you've tried the Trader Joe's one as well. Um, let me know in the comments below. And I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.